Hey guys, uh, today we're gonna attempt to repair a broken mp4 video file. This is the file right here. I named it actually broken for ease of use later. It's 10.6 gigabytes video. And as you see, nothing goes on. Even if I push forward or backwards, nothing really works on the player. And even if I try to open it with a VLC that most people would probably be saying right now, well, you didn't try VLC because VLC has all of that. Well, let me try it with VLC as well. And as you see here, let me block the sound so we don't have those problems. As you see, the seconds are counted here, but there's no video. There's no video feed at all. And here I have a good, known and for privacy reasons since these are not my videos i might uh, blur the video itself and i'm gonna block the sound just to prove to you that it works as you see right here and i'm gonna take this out so what we're gonna do now let me close this i put them in one folder there's these two small tools right here that uh, will be found on the link in the description and first one Let's open a folder that will be our workspace folder. Video repair uh, space. I'm just going to put it on a folder for convenience. Open this folder and here FFmpeg will be the first one. I'll take these files here, as you see here, and drop it right here. When you drop it here, close this first one. And when you open this, you'll have this stuff inside. Open the bin and you have three files on the bin. Now go to recover mp4 xc and I will copy these and drop them in here too and close this one. You can uh, delete these two instructional pieces right there and now you will have to get your two videos, the broken one and the good one both and put them on this bin right here because what's happening right now is that we're uh taking one video that's broken but the other video that's good and known to be working is taken from the same device that's important so far i've had success only if the good video is taken from the same device because it has the same information and from here we will have to go to our cmd but cmd right click on it to run as administrator otherwise it will not work when you run as administrator well let me put this a little bit slower here and this bigger so you guys can see it first command will be to change directory cd space slash forward d space and then you come here to the folder where we have our uh, workspace just click on top and copy the directory uh, path and after we do that we come back here and we paste it as you see here and then hit enter and now it has recognized our uh, folder like our uh, cmd is working inside our folder and to verify that you type dir for directory dir and yes all our files are right here now we know we are in a good track now we go is we want to trigger the recovery.mp4.exe first how we do that we have to input a small command here that will be a uh, recover underscore mp4.exe uh, space and you type the name of your good video in my case i named the good video good and after you type this one you type good that mp4 i suggest you name your uh, good known video and the bad video with easy names so you can type it here after the recover mp4.exe and then space good.mp4 this is the file the good file here don't mistake that so depending on what your file is uh, named that's how you should type here and then you do a uh, dash dash or minus minus analyze so now we are telling the software to go and analyze the good video the video data that it has the audio data and all that stuff so it has a good information before we proceed then to tell the software to copy from that good video and reconstruct our broken video and keep in mind those two videos are not the same video huh? they are not the same video they're simply shot from the same device and then hit enter and as after you hit enter you will wait for it it will give you more instructions now on screen in a minute just be patient depending on how big your video is it will take time in my case it's a one hour and a half video almost 10 gigabyte video 
so it will take its time but it's worth it and we have no other choice so let's wait as you see now it has finished analyzing and uh when we go here it says uh, on the screen instructions here it says now run the following command to start recovering and when you copy the, I, I suggest you copy both these as you see here copy open a text file here on the side inside your same folder and uh, I'm gonna name mine just instructions right here open this uh, text file paste them in here so you have a record of them and I'm gonna hit save and after you save this one now we're gonna copy this one the first line here copy it and when you paste here as you see you'll have to come back to this where it says corrupted file this part we need to delete and name our bad file in my in uh, my instruction here as you see i named my broken file just broken so you'll have to type right here broken.mp4 so we are telling the software which is our broken file and mine is broken.mp4 and then hit enter again and now it's analyzing the broken file itself and as i said before depending on your uh, video length it will take its time and you just have to be patient and as you see it has finished doing its thing now after quite a while actually look at the whole lines that it went through and here we go back to our notes where we took before the second line it said this one right here and we copy this whole thing copy and we paste it right here as you see now we are telling the software to take the information from the good file and merge audio and video of the bad file and attempt to repair it based on the good file example and then now we hit enter and it will start making its magic here and you'll see the file will appear on your folder right here as result.mp4 and let's hit enter now it's encoding and decoding and doing all that beautiful stuff so just be patient with it and after it's done now we should see a video result an mp4 file as you see right here is our result mp4 video file and for privacy reasons i'm gonna blur the video but this video is the broken one from here so now this is our result and yes i'm gonna blur it but that is, as you see it has picture and it has audio versus the broken one that was right here that doesn't have picture or audio in some cases might have only audio and no picture but most cases might be broken to no audio no picture and the result came around six gigabytes because i didn't let the whole process go to the very end but as you see it's working and now the video has been recovered as good as it can be don't expect it to be perfect every time you can rerun it or you can rerun it finding a even better working file and you'll see that this method actually works and i that's all i had to say for today this method is actually good and it's what you would call computer magic this is it and uh, the script the links to both pieces of software will be in the description below and i hope you can repair some video files mp4 files to be exact and uh, we'll see you next time please hit like and subscribe if you learned something from this video and we'll see you bye